Kinderlach. We are live! Welcome to the Maor Live Show! I'm your host, Rabbi Levy! On today's show, we'll be hearing an amazing story about lighting Shabbos candles and drawing a beautiful picture. We'll be learning a sicha about leaving Galos and we'll read your mitzvah notes. For today's show, you will need a few things. Number one, your Ma'or papers, which can be found in the description of the video, or a plain piece of paper. Number two, something to color with, like colored pencils or crayons. Number three, your listening ears. And number four, and most importantly, your chayes to sing along with the Rebbe. Boys and girls, remember to hold on to your papers till after the video. Send them in to our WhatsApp page and you'll be entered into a raffle to win a Maor gift package. Remember to include your name and location when sending the picture. Okay, boys and girls. It's time to say the 12 psukim. Let's begin with the Pasuk of Tata. Phenomenal! Now it's time to say Shema! Shema! Yisrael! Adonai! Eloheinu! Adonai! Echad! Great job! Let's do it together! Bechol! Bechol! I am loving that chayas. Let's go to the Pasuk of Kol Yisrael. Yisrael. Yesh. Lahem. Chayla. Liayam. Haba. Shenema. Vame. Kolam. Sadikim. Liayam. Yersho, Are, Nate, Matai, Mate, Yadai, Lazeby. Great job! Now it's time for Key Curry! Okay, the next pasuk, Vehine. Vehine, Hashem, Nitzav, Olav, Omeray, Kol, Haaretz, Kuvada, Umabet, Olav, Ovachem, Kolos, Valei, In, Avda. The very first Pasuk in our holy Taira, Bereshit! Amazing! Let's go to Vishinanta! This 
one is one of my favorites, Yogaiti! Yogaiti! Vlog! Matsasi! Let's go to the Pasuk of Ve'ahavta! Ve'ahavta! Ve'echa! Kamaycha! Rabbi! Akiva! Oime! Zeh! Klal! Badal! Batara! We are almost there! Vizeh! Give me all the chais you got. It's the last pasuk. Gisma. Yisrael. Be'aiso. Perush. Shekol. Mi. Shehu. Nidera. Yisrael. Yesh. Loi. Yismayach. Besimcha. Hashem. Hashem. Okay, boys and girls. Yechi! We want to tell the Rebbe the words of the new song that we're singing with Mashiach, right? So I'm just going to read him. Shh! Am Yisrael, have no fear. Mashiach will be here this year. We want Mashiach now. We don't want to wait. Okay? Wow, Kinderlach, that was amazing. I could really feel your chayis coming in onto my end of the video. And now it's time to hear a story about lighting Shabbos candles. After the story's over, we will draw the picture together. If you do not have the Ma'or picture page, you can download it from the description of the video. And now, listen closely and watch as the story unfolds. Once upon a time, not so long ago, in England. <laughs> Cherry dear, it's five o'clock. Papa just ended work and will be home soon so we can light the Shabbos candles. Quickly, get dressed for Shabbos. And when you're done, there is a table waiting for you to set. But do I have to? Cherry, Shabbos is a very holy day. We honor it by lighting candles with the whole family getting dressed up and having our special Shabbos supper. You already know that every week we light candles at six. Now come on, hurry up, let's get ready for Shabbos. Okay, mother. 
ודנו חסד מסוד השבת סוד הבלשי נספר ונפין פזי גשלי זלמן דן גשף דנו קום תלהם ונטוס החיבר וזי בן שליך תנל מחקידיש וכו'. That was the Friday schedule year-round, winter and summer. Work ended at 5, followed by candle lighting at 6 p.m. One day. Cherry dear, it's 5 o'clock. Time to change into Shabbos clothes. Mother! Yes? I was thinking, can I light Shabbos candles with you this week? I found out from a friend in school that young girls should also light. Can I, can I please? Why, that's a splendid idea. <laughs> My daughter is maturing and following in her mother's footsteps. <laughs> Come six o'clock on any given Friday, you can find Cherry and Mother lighting Shabbos candles together. But that all changed one fateful day. Mother, Mother! Cherry? Whatever happened to make you rush in like this from school? Mother, I can't light Shabbos candles today at 6. It's wrong. We are not allowed. What do you mean we are not allowed? Mother, it is now winter time. That means the sun sets earlier, around 4 o'clock. I was told candles must be lit before sunset. I read all about it in a booklet I got about candle lighting. By the time Papa finishes work at 5 and comes home, it's already Shabbos. We can't wait for Papa to light. It's too late. <gasps> you want to light without Father? Mother, it's Shabbos. The father came home from work and saw one candle burning. What is this? Mother and Cherry are lighting two different times? Eventually, Cherry got her mother to start lighting Shabbos candles at the correct time according to Halacha. Now, standing in the time before the Gula, we Kinderlach can bring more Taira and Kedusha into our homes. As we learn many ways to keep Halacha better, we can try to do it the right way at home and school. If we make the changes with Derech Eretz and enthusiasm, the entire home will be transformed. Wow, Kinderlach, what an unbelievable story. Don't ever forget the power that each of you Kinderlach have to bring more Torah and Kiddusha into your home. And now, please take out your coloring page and your pencils or crayons and let's color. Okay, Kinderlach, let's begin by drawing the window. Remember, it's time to light Shabbos candles, which means it's sunset outside. So use your dark yellows, reds, and oranges to show the sky getting darker. Okay, now it's time to draw Mother. Great job! Let's continue by drawing Cherry.
You're doing great. Don't forget to draw Cherry and Mother in their special Shabbos clothing. And now, it's time to draw the highlight of our story. I want to see you draw the most beautiful Shabbos candles. Of course, beautiful candlesticks must be on a beautiful table. So now, draw the table and the tablecloth. We're getting closer. Now that all the items in the house are colored, let's begin with the house itself. Color in the window shades.
And now let's finish our beautiful drawing by making sure the walls have a beautiful, nice color. Okay, Kinderlach, now it's mitzvah no time! For our first mitzvah, we have the Davidson family from Oak Park, Michigan. Mordechai vacuumed the floor after Shabbos without being told to, and Yesef Yehuda and Freda Bracha peeled potatoes for supper. From Crown Heights, New York, we have Hannah Gurkov, who said 12 kapitulach of Tehillim for people who are sick and need to feel better. The Cement family from Boston, Massachusetts. Hillel said to Hillem and Schneer gave Staka for all those suffering from the coronavirus. Mendel Castle from Toronto, Canada, davened so nicely from his sitter this past Shabbos. Beruya Salmon from New Haven, Connecticut gave Staka. Yisrael Noyach Volovic from Los Angeles, California beat his Yitzhara and washed for Hamaitzi. From Sao Paulo, Brazil, Hannah Broner gave extra tzedakah. We have the Duba family from Crown Heights. Levi Yitzchak said to Hillim, together with Klal Yisrael, and Esther organized her room all by herself. Wow, that's amazing! Schneer Zalman kissed the mezuzah before bedtime, and Devorah Leah helped clean for Pesach. And now, Kinderlach, it's time to learn a sicha with the Rebbe. Remember to have your question papers. You can print them from the description of the video. We will go over the questions after each section. I'm so proud of you, Maishala. Today in Shul, you were following along by Kriya, looking inside your Chumash the whole time, especially by Asaras Adibris. Thanks, Ta. I was thinking how we've been so long in this Gallus. Gallus is so hard. How can I and all Yitin have the strength to not be affected by all the hardships? How can we leave this Gallus? This question the Rebbe spoke about, and he answered it with what we just read in Shul. Section 1 Okay, boys and girls, I hope you are listening well to Section 1. Here's the first question. What does Meishele ask his father? Use words from Meishele's thought bubble to fill in the blanks. Gullus is so blank and blank. How can we stay blank and not be affected by this Gullus? How will we ever get out of this blank? Okay, Kinderlach, we're about to begin section two. Listen and follow with the Rebbe. Put a check next to each of these words when you hear them. Aseres hadibres, tzivais Hashem, anoichi Hashem elekecha, shtarkait. Is al treitzer gleich hon in der Aseres hadibres, is gleich der Ron ips ad Rebbechter sorgt zu jeder Rieden und zu jeder Kind und speziell zu den Kindern von Zivis Hashem. A jeder von euch soll wissen, als er nicht ich habe Hashem in der Kirche, als der Rebbechter sorgt auf sich, als er ist der dein Gott und deine Starkheit, und Hashem hat sich sicher mit Eretz Mitzrayim, wo das gibt es die Sicherheit, as we bald an the gate mit dem Kommandier in Schief, mit dem Nebesten allein, wo es hat ein Teil ist genommen, Jotze Hayem in Mitzrayim, ist doch sicher, als er wird ich ein Teil ist nehmen, jeder von euch und jeder von uns und dem ganzen niedischen Volk, von dem istrigen Golos, und es wird sein Moschiach nahe. We just heard the Aseris Adipris. Right. And how does it begin? Anaychi Hashem. Hashem says, I am Hashem, your Hashem, who took you out of Mitzrayim. Yes, I am your Hashem and your strength. 
I was the one who took you out of the hard and bitter Gullus Mitzrayim. Therefore, you don't have to worry in this Gullus. Oh, I understand now. Just as Hashem took us out of Mitzrayim, He will take us out of this Gullus. Yup, Hashem is with you now and always, and gives you the strength to prepare yourself for Mashiach now. So with Hashem at my side, I can conquer this Gullus together with all the Yidin. I'm skipping home to tell everyone about it. Okay, Kinderlach, question number three. Was Gullus Mitzrayim hard? And how did the Yidin get out? Question number four. How will we get out of this hard Gullus? And question number five. How do we have the strength to overcome this Gullus? Circle or underline the correct answer. And now, Kinderlach, it's time for another Mitzvah Note Time! From North Miami Beach, Florida, we have the Rimler family. Mendel gave Staka for Moi Yishitim, and Musia Davin gave Tzedaka and was Snis for Mashiach. Mendel Proust from Newton, Massachusetts gave his Tati milk for his coffee. From Sky Lake, Florida, Musia Karp was gentle with her baby sister and helps mommy when she cries. From Amsterdam, Holland, Yosef Yitzchak Avers played nicely with his brothers and came back in when mommy called and washed his hands nicely. The Vyshetsky family from Brooklyn, New York. Shmuel listened nicely to his online class and Mendel helped clean the house for Pesach. From Crown Heights, New York, we have the Gurkha family. Ezreal and Mushka called their elder bubbies and sang songs to make them happy. And finally, from Amsterdam, Holland, Maya Simcha Avers followed along nicely when Tehillim was being said. Wow, so many mitzvahs. There's no question that all these mitzvahs will help bring Mashiach faster. If you want to be on the next video, remember to do a mitzvah and ask your parents to send a picture via WhatsApp. Our number is 347-770-3040. I hope to see you all do so many more mitzvahs. Kinderlach, please join me in saying to Hillim for all our fellow Yidin who are in need of a refua shalema. We will first say Kapitel Chaf, and then we will say the first and last two psukim of the Rebbe's Kapitel. Lam Natsayach Mizmer Le David Yan Chadino Ibiyayim Tzara Yisa Gevcha Sheim Elehe Yaakov Yishlach Ezrecha Mi Kaidesh Umi Tziyayin Yisa Deka Yisgar kol min chaisecha, ve'oylascha yidash nesela. Yiten lecha chilvavecha, v'chol atzascha yeimalei. Neran rabbi Yeshua secha, v'shem eleheinu nidgoil. Yeimalei adinoi kol mishalei secha. Ata yadaiti kyeishi adinoi mishichai. Yanei mishmei kachai v'gvurei sheisha yeminoi. Eile vareche ve'ele vasusim. V'anachnu v'shem adinoi eleheinu naskir. Heima koru v'nafalo. V'anachnu kamnu v'nisoidod. Adinoi ha'ishiyom. Hamelech ya'aneinu v'yayim koreinu. And now, the first and last two psukim of the Rebbe's capital. Hoidu ladinoi ki ta'iv ki le'olam chazdoi. Yeimai no Yisrael ki le'olam chazdoi. Eli ata ve'oideka elai hai arei memeka. Hoidu ladinoi ki ta'iv ki le'olam chazdoi. Okay, Kinderlach, it's time to pick a winner from all the drawings and question sheets that came in after the first Ma'or live show. Are you ready? And the winner of the Ma'or gift package is... Zevi Fort 
from Yerushalayim, Eretz Yisrael. Boys and girls, you all did such an amazing job. Here are some of the best drawings and question sheets that you, Kinderlach, sent in. And now to end off, let's sing a Simcha Diginigin with the Rebbe. The Rebbe wants we should sing with the words, everybody thought, Al Tiro Mi Boys and girls, thank you so much for joining us. Remember, we are waiting to hear from you. Please ask your tatis and mommies to send in your drawings, your worksheets, and your mitzvah notes so we can read them on the next video. In the schus of our achtas and learning, may the Rebbe lead us out of this gallus now!